Watch of this! See that thing. Cold storm. Woo. I know y'all been seeing a lot of the the uh the wide body. The wide body scat pack, but I ain't forget about the truck. So today is a glorious day. Oh, first of all, I forgot my introduction. Watch the series. Uh, 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 uh. What's going on guys? It's your guys here's mindset back with another video and today is a glorious day not only because not only because of this mod but because i'm alive you're alive you're watching this so you're gonna get a chance to check out this mod this was a, a much needed mod once i pull up i'm gonna go over the details uh, I gotta make my way around to the garage or whatnot. Stay tuned. We about to go get it in. Oh, look at that thing. That thing looks nice. Damn, that dog looks nice. I'm not even into dogs. I'm not even into dogs, but man, that little that little joker look nice. It make me want to get one. But man, not because. Look, respect. Come on, Ali. Seatbelt on. Safety first. See if it's still gonna go off. All right, but respect to those, to all you pet owners or whatnot, because it's so much money that you gotta pay for these god dog on me pets. Excuse that beeping. Oh. You can see on this thing, see it's badgeless. See, I got it, I got a, it didn't, so when it rains, you can kind of still see it. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but remember I had D badge that thing. Took, what years so i think if anything i could just buff this out or whatnot so that wouldn't be an issue wide body thing right there sitting, sitting pretty with the decal with the decal of course but anyway um if you haven't subscribed make sure you hit that subscribe button make sure you hit the notification blah, 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 notific <laughs> notification bell uh and also make sure you follow the instagram series underscore lanes let me show you boom Serious underscore lanes. I have to put the other decal that I put didn't put on the uh on the Hellcat because it was too big. I'm gonna put it on the truck. So if anything, let's get to the mod. Alright, so the mod for today is going for the move all this stuff out the way. So we can work. So we can work. All right. So the mod of today is replacing the grill. So I have an aftermarket grill. I'ma try to keep the RT on the grill, but this will be replaced. Um, I was thinking about getting the same one, but with this grill. See right there with this grill, it basically covers. But yeah, let me just take take it out the box and show you guys. But I've been waiting so long. I've been waiting so long to get this done. So it's no. Hold on, don't hit the, don't hit the. Is it gonna hit? It will hit. I need to put something right there. Do 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 do. See. Off up there so I don't scratch nothing. So let's go ahead and open up this thing. looks of it just looking at it, I don't know if they got the A-tools grills I'm a little nervous about this I have to see if they got the little enclosed grills in there
you can see the grill. I was worried that it didn't have the cones because it didn't look like it over the uh over this little paper and stuff. So I was a little worried, but this is the grill. That thing look nice. That thing look nice. The color is off. It looks this is a little bit like um I wanna say like a matte silver. And this is of course like a I don't know the actual paint color, but like I said, the whole point is to replace the grill and slowly implement. So I might do some things with this or whatnot. But as you see, it comes with the harness to light up these jokers. So you see each one uh, has a harness on there. So that was, that's pretty convenient. So I don't have to um, hot, wire, hot wire anything. I need to clean, I need my engine too. I, this is embarrassing, but I'm just gonna keep it 100. But look, I have literally neglected my baby. Literally neglected. So we gonna go ahead and get this going. But man, I need to clean my bay up. Like I said, I've been gone for over a year, so that's to be expected. I need somebody keep texting me. Oh yeah, that's how that thing gonna look. That's how that thing gonna look right there. I like that, I like that setup. That's a nice setup. And I also have to change one of my LEDs, which is uh, which is another reason why I'm also doing this mod. So you just pop off these jokers here. Boop, 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 boop. See, this one is kinda off, so let me get my, let me get my, my kit that I got from, um, from uh, Harbor Freight, Harbor Freight 2. So. This day use these so uh, I'll put the the latest video uh, when I use these when I took off the uh, when I took off the uh, what is what is it when I debash the truck and the, uh, the wide body so so we're gonna use we're gonna try this one let's see what this one do so you just slide this thing under like so and then and then once you catch it they just pop up. Probably might have to use a little bit of force, but you get the you get the motion. So now mind you, I got like like four, four or five different ones. So it really it's really like a preference deal. But you can see that it kinda you kinda get from like trying to yank it with your nails and things like that. So oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Thing will go crazy on you if you use force so just make sure you have an even pull and then you see how, e how easy this is you just use this as a lever and then boom 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 I think this one is off you see you see what I did now most of my stuff like I said I had the truck for years so most of the stuff is a little bit eroded so I'm gonna have to give me some more of these little uh, push pop-up deals I'm gonna have to find the part number but I'm gonna set this to the side with all of the little pushes, pushes, uh, push buttons, pin buttons, pins, and then I have to figure out what these, uh, what number grade these are. So I got, so to get to the grill, I have one, two, three, four, and that's just to pop off the grill. Now everything comes. It comes self, so they just gonna bolt right on the the one uh the same one. So you see, I got one, two, three, four, and then they have this uh, pre-made notch uh, that's on the grill as well. So, like I said, if you already change your headlights, then you kind of already know what to do with your truck or whatnot for the ram for this model. So it's pretty much self-explanatory. So let me go ahead and get to that. And then we gonna we gonna talk a little bit more about what I'm doing to this thing. Stay tuned. All right, All right so I already loosened up some of them. I forgot to put you guys on video. So 10, mil 10 millimeter, get these babies off. Get that wind blowing, so you might hear a little bit of that wind too. So 10 millimeter. This thing off. As you see, four. 
and then I want to put them in a secure place. I know I said leave them on there, but since this is going to be replaced, that means that I can simply just know where it's at. So it's right by, it's right by the uh, the wide body wheel. <laughs> All right. So remember the groove, that little rivet that I was telling you guys about. So you just pop right out. See. So they got like a. So you can either go. So the grill either has. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it either has this clamp that just seats in or it has like the little rivet push that that grill has so for like aftermarket now i think i'm going to go over this later but oh wow yeah i forgot i gotta do my uh i gotta change my headlight i gotta change my uh i forgot i gotta change my led that was another reason why i want to do this both at the same time you don't have to take off the grill, but it makes it much easier. So I need to get into, uh, I think it was this headlight. I need to turn it on so I can get to it. So I can take uh, this joke off. So just hold on, stay tuned. I'm sure you guys already know I changed the headlight, but um, I have the HED, HED, LED. So it might take me a little minute, but stay tuned. Make sure you hit that subscribe button too. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. I appreciate you. Stay tuned. So the most important frustrating part about this again is the fact that, I don't know if you guys can see that, but right here, it's a loose uh, lever. So with this lever, hold on, let me see if we can get a get some, get some light in there. But that's a lever right here. It's a little dark, there you go. So it's a lever right here. Somebody trying to act a fool, they trying to call me out. But it's a lever right here. And with this lever, it locks and unlocks. So push it up to uh, to uh, unlock it, pull it down to lock it in. But this is the most frustrating part. Uh, <laughs> aside from taking out the lights in these trucks. And then you can see here that I done scarred myself up trying to get underneath this wheel well to find it because it's a pain in the butt you can see that i don't know if you can see that yeah there you go so it's a pain in the butt you got to turn the wheel uh the opposite side oh my god all the other stuff so i'm going to change these out see i got the ballast so i already took out the light because i have to figure out what they use so like i said i had the the truck for years so now one of the sides so i might replace the other side so i won't have to so I won't have to deal with this again. All right, let me give you another tip. I'm just throwing out tips for this install. So for this mod. So if you are changing, and you can, I don't know if you guys can hear it, but the, but the actual, it has like a, I don't know if you guys can hear that. You guys can hear that? So the tip is, if you're changing out one bulb and you have a special set and you don't know uh, how it goes, because the, with these LEDs, it's something different. But luckily, I took it to a shop and they already pre-wired uh, everything that I had to do. All I had to do was just find a replacement. Now, it was it was hell and water to find a replacement, the same identical one, because I don't know uh, what kit they had on there. I didn't know what specific kit they had on there. But this is not needed no more. But needless to say, make sure you were actually uh, getting the truck or getting your vehicle or whatnot and turn on the uh, turn on your lights to make sure that it actually works. Because if you don't you put everything together, you're gonna be highly disappointed. You're gonna be highly upset, especially with all these cuts and bruises I got. I would have been mad. But that's another tip for you guys. So let me go ahead and get this installed. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the other one just so they, they can be identical. You might as well do you might as well do it right, you know. Don't have, don't have a a job, you know what I'm saying? So stay tuned. Check that out. It's raining again, raining again. Not my best friend, but oh my god, I'm I'm so I'm so pissed. Like I'm just gonna show y'all. Oh my god. So apparently, see if. Apparently, look at that. They sent me the wrong grill. Look at this. Look at that. 
So I was getting ready to I was getting ready to uh, attach everything. You see, I have all of the little lines and connections trying to attach these amber lights to my uh, to my fog lights so I can control them. So I pull out my bolt meter trying to figure out the ground and stuff. And I say, man, let me just go ahead. Let me just go ahead and dress up everything. And as I get ready to dress up the stuff, you can see it in my face. I'm just wow now i had i had the uh i gotta see if i can return it i had the grill for maybe like two months i ordered it from amazon so i'm gonna see if i can get that thing shit back and get my money back because um that's <sighs> man <laughs> yesterday it was the tent now I got this, so I'm just showing you guys that everything is not gonna always be perfect. Needless to say, yeah, I'm frustrated. I was so uh, uh, motivated to get this thing done, but anyway, the, the the color offset, I really didn't like anyway, so I guess it worked out for the better. So let me go ahead and uh, figure this thing out, figure this thing out. Um, needless to say, guys, make sure you uh, comment make sure you subscribe if you guys had this type of issue but the one successful thing that I did get out of this um, this I guess trying to mod or mod day is uh, I did uh, I did redo my HID light so that end up coming out uh, real good so needless to say make sure you hit that sub button make sure you hit that like button make sure you hit the notification bell as well and make sure you stay serious I appreciate you guys for watching watch some serious Watch the beard!